So it seems that that thing is the thing that caused the flood? Question mark? I don't know. Okay, so at least you know where we're going after this. Yep. Following you, because you know where you were. There we go. This way. I don't know why, but you just kind of your mic just for some reason does static whenever one of us isn't talking. I don't know why. So I guess we just that's just incentive to keep talking all the time, because otherwise a very annoying static is going to happen. See? <laughs> Actually, you probably can't tell, but... No, I don't hear... Yeah, okay, so that's where we went up into that, into where the yeah. cells were. So then we come down, down here is where you went? Yeah. Go left and there's back there. Ah. Oh, more dudes over this way. Eh, grenade. Um, target the elite with this. Yeah, I know. Grenade. Ow. We got There's another one. Ooh, I'm almost dead if there's a health oh, thing in here. Oh, another set of uh, thingies here. There should be a health pack in one of these, I think. Oh, there's a guy. There's, these guys are alive, actually, so they might not actually have a health pack for us. Cutscene. Coming here was reckless. You two know better than this. <laughs> Marines, lock and load your weapons. Let's be ready to move. While the Covenant had us locked up in here, I overheard the guards talking about this ring room. They called it Halo. One moment, sir. Accessing the Covenant battle net. According to the data in their networks, the ring has some kind of deep religious significance. If I'm analyzing this correctly, they believe that Halo is some kind of weapon, one with vast... Whoever controls Halo controls the fate of the universe. Now I see. I have intercepted a number of messages about a Covenant searching, scouting for a control room. I thought they were looking for the bridge of a cruiser that I damaged during the battle of the ring. But they must be looking for Halo's control room. That's bad news. If Halo is a weapon and the Covenant gained control of it, they'll use it against us and wipe out the entire human race. I have a new mission for you. We need to beat the cover up to Halo's control room. Marines, Marines let's move. move. Yes, sir. Okay, sir. Chief, you have the point. So this looks like this is a new mission. We should head back to the shuttle bay and call for evac. Just look for... Oh, yes. Hopefully there's one. Yeah. All those dudes. Oop. Two of them. One down. The other's down. Nice. Oh, there's a bunch more dudes. Okay, I think we're gonna have to just after this, or after they're done attacking us, we'll have to leave because it's oh, we're already we 47 minutes into video and I gotta go to bed. <laughs> so let's just save and quit here. Uh, okay. How do I save? Yeah, hit escape and then. Doesn't seem to be anything that saves, but this is like the beginning of a mission. I think. I think so. Or no, because this still says the truth and reconciliation, which is the mission that we started. We got to get. At this point, I think to finish this, we got to get him back to 
alive back to the bay and then they he takes off or something but and that's probably the end of the mission then yeah object must return to the shuttle bay for extraction oh i hit tab oh i just noticed if you hit tab you go back i tried hitting tab for like a scoreboard but you hit tab and you go to the old version of the game oh wow so you can go from this which is like the old version you have like translucent needles in the needler and yeah, the HUD that looks different. And you go to this, and then it looks super nice. And this is like Halo 4 level quality or something. You got like original, where I can barely see you in the dark. And then there's this, where it's brightly lit room. That's pretty neat. Okay, uh, I'm going to end this video here, because we're 50 minutes in um, for recording. And then we'll just do a very short one of the rest of the mission. Okay. Alright, and now we got to finish this. Hello. Eh. I'm too lazy to kill you, so I'm just gonna throw a grenade at him. Everything's dead. Nice. Get some ammo. like, I got a shield, I'll survive, and then he just dies, because that grenade's been stuck to him. Uh, I'm actually gonna swap for more ammo. Wonder, I wonder if the animations change at all. No, the animations don't change. Although the sounds change when you change game. Invisible sword guy in here. Wait, I wonder what he looks like in this old version of the game mode. See him over there? There's two of them. Oh, all you see is the laser, the swords on these guys. Wait. The sound, it sounds way different. It actually sounds pretty cool. Be like, I want to do this in the middle of a firefight, and I can just do it this way. Yeah, I know. It's pretty neat. Well, I don't know why you'd want to play like the old version. I guess maybe if you were like nostalgic or something, you wanted to play the new version, or the old version on the computer, you could punch. use the charge shot for this. I'd probably be better with that. So now we gotta fight our way down. Fun. I'm just walking on one of the marine's heads. slow. Why is it showing us to go up, a up on top? Oh, we must not have uh, 
interacted with something. I'll go check. Oh, never mind. Now we got a cutscene. I did the door. Everybody, mount up. Let's get on board. Maybe we could have done that from the upper level. Whatever. Maybe. Whatever. Give me a minute to interface with the ship's controls. Uh, no need. I'll take this bird out myself. Captain! Hunter! Oh, fun. Hang on. There we go. Now we're on to the next mission. There we go. Yeah, we'll watch the cutscene and then we'll yeah. play it here. Because it's really late. The Covenant believe that what they call the silent, silent cartographer, cartographer is somewhere under the island. island. The cartographer is a map room that will lead us to Halo's control center. The island, the island has, has multiple, multiple structures, structures and installations. One of them contains the map room. Alright, I guess we're gonna have to actually, maybe... Actually, no, we can just hide behind some rocks and quit. Yeah. Alright, um, so there's that. First, like, two or three missions of the first Halo game. In one night. So, cool. All right. this map looks really different when in old game version. Although it's actually pretty decently playable, it actually looks like you know it's bright enough you can actually see stuff. The difference in detail, though, like you look at this side here, flat in the old game, nice and smooth in the new game. The grass. Oh yeah, grass doesn't even exist in the old one. The rocks have no texture, the trees have no leaves. These guys are just mostly... Like, they have no detail in their face, but they have detail in their face here. And it's actually, they actually change. They have, go from one spike on their back to two. It's pretty weird. Alright, you're right, it's bedtime. Alright, let's go. Put her down. Alright, that's that. More will happen eventually. We'll play this more. So, yeah, I gotta actually, like, edit some of these, though, and get through them, so... It'll be a while before we play to continue this. Yeah.